welcome to my favorite place in the house, my kitchen, where I make healthy and delicious recipes. So, last night I posted a poll on my Insta story and I asked would people rather see healthy pasta sauce or healthy pizza? So, let's see which one won. Which one won? That's interesting. Um, Pizza won by a mile, because pizza's amazing, and everybody loves it. So, still gonna do healthy pasta sauce in the future, but tonight we're gonna make some healthy pizza. Two things before I start. Number one, if there's any recipes that you'd like to see healthified, healthified, is that a word? I don't know, but you get the point. Um, leave a comment below or send me a message, anything that you want to see. And number two, like this video and subscribe because it really helps my channel. Before you start, make sure you preheat your oven to 350 degrees. So there are alternatives that I use to make my pizza healthy. First one is the main ingredient and also the highest calorie ingredient, which is the crust. This is what I use for my crust. It is a multi-grain wrap. You can use any wheat wrap, multi-grain wrap. Make sure you check the calories. This is the perfect size and it's only 60 calories with six grams of protein. So this is what I'm gonna be using for my crust. Next is the sauce. If you've never checked the back of a Jod pizza sauce, it's full of unnecessary added ingredients a ton of salt, a ton of sugar, and stuff that you don't need. So what I do is I get a small can of unsalted tomato sauce, and then I add some garlic powder and some pink Himalayan salt. No measurements for that, just put some in, mix it around, and then taste test it. So next thing is the cheese. This is the cheese that I use. You can get any fat-free or reduced fat mozzarella cheese that you find. This is 70 calories for 28 grams, so I measured it out exactly 28 grams and now we can start making the pizza. So what I have for toppings is some scallions, some red bell pepper, garlic, purple onion, some basil leaves, hot boiled eggs, spinach, mushrooms, and the best tomatoes in the world. They're like little yellow sweet tomatoes. So this is everything that I'm going to be putting on my pizza. So to make it easier when I throw it in the oven, I'm going to put it on a baking sheet now. So just start putting everything on. You would do a regular pizza. So I have all my toppings on my pizza, and last but not least, I'm gonna put a lot of oregano on. So it's all ready to be thrown in the oven for about five minutes. So there you go, quick and easy, healthy pizza. Only takes 10 minutes to make, and it's only 150 calories.